What is up people of YouTube? I'm your host Vernon. Let's fish that. All right, ladies and gents, I've had the privilege of fishing the Las Vegas Valley four and a half years and in that time I've had some amazing catches and in this video I just want to highlight a few of those catches so let's get to it all right guys hopefully I can land this guy it's on all right guys I'm fishing this little shelf part I suddenly saw a school of bait fish boiling around cast my lure in there and managed to hook my first strike bass. Quickly gonna get a measurement on this guy. Alright so nine zero point nine six kilograms thinking a two pound almost a kilogram Nice little striped bass. Alright guys, I'm gonna release him over here. Down to the depths he goes. mouth this little guy was hooked in his mouth so I'm happy with this little catch uh, I don't know what fish this is so I will have to do some research but this will be a new species for me in any case nice lovely little orange fins there we have our little fish Still don't know what it is, but I'll do some research, give a photo, but it is definitely a new species for me. It's actually a bass, a smallmouth bass. This will be my first smallmouth caught on corn, and it's quite a nice size fish as well. There we are guys, smallmouth bass landed on some corn. Alright, so new personal best smallmouth bass, this one caught on corn, totally unexpected. Let's get this guy back into the water. Alright guys, first fish on. It's kind of stuck in the grass, so it's difficult to see what it is or where it is. Luckily we brought the net with us, especially for fishing the dock. And there we are guys, tiny little channel catfish. <laughs> Alright, not a tiny catfish, big channel catfish. I'm gonna get a weight and measurement on this one. Alright guys, nice big channel cat. Quickly gonna get him back into the water. All right guys, we got another fish on. Feels like a good one. Nice big head on this one. Not as fat as they can be. It's still a pretty decent sized one. Alright guys, as I'm going to prepare to leave this fish, this is actually my new PB, 
my new personal best carp caught here from Lake Mead. Let's release him. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we finally have a fish on. Not the fish that we were hoping to get, but still quite exciting, because this is gonna be a new species for me. We have a Playco, little armored catfish. There we go, nice big Playco. First fish landed for today. Let's quickly get the size quickly gonna get a size on this guy so we know what my new PB for Playcos are this little guy took a fly still got him hooked in the lip so luckily I brought my scales out here let's get a weight measurement on this Playco all right so it's a 400 gram fish that's going to be a 0 0.87 pound so not even a pound but it is a nice size playco just thinking something like 30 centimeters now if you're worried that I have my scale hooked through his gills not a problem we are not releasing this fish they are not native to this place they're not supposed to be in these waters so this one is not going to get released guys so this fish was caught with a net it's not caught with rod and reel so it does not count towards my life list but i know they are only found in the colorado river uh, that is why we're going to take nice care of this one to ensure that it swims away uh, it was caught in a small pool so i'm going to release it back into the river rather than it being stuck in a small pool somewhere so again it's not a new species for my life list because it wasn't caught with hook and line but nice little sucker fish we're quickly going to get him back into the water So I'm releasing him on this side so he can swim back into the river. A strong kick from him and off he goes. Oh, okay. uh -huh. oh look here! Bird has got a daily double. <laughs> Don't lose a pole man! Don't lose your pole! Luckily I have big hands can have both poles. In one hand, got two nice sized fish. I think it's fine if we can get a net. Oh, yeah, we'll get it. Oh, man, that's a good one. This one on a smaller hook, so. There we go, two fish at the same time. <laughs> oh. Whoa, look at that the big, big one. one. Come on, get in there, get in there. Dude, that is a huge fish. Here we go. Charlie, get away from it. That is a huge, huge fish. All right, guys, so in all honesty, this is probably my biggest Lahontan cutthroat trout, my new PB. Just quickly getting the hook out of there. Dude, Dude that, is, that is a huge fish for this pond. And lovely colors on him as oh, well. Absolutely beautiful. Clear, clear to see that. Is that it? Dude, that's, that's a, a big, big fish. fish. Give him some oxygen quickly. Well done for keeping him on. All right, so you can clearly see the lovely orange on his throat there. That's how we know it's a cutthroat trout. Lovely reds and browns on this one. Beautiful fish. Get him back into the water. Amazing job, Brian. That was a tiny hook too. Yeah. It's just 
And off he goes. Swimming back ever so slowly. Back he goes to his hole. <laughs> there we go, guys. On the little shaky head. Got a nice big bass. I did not bring my net out here with me, so we're going to have to boat flip this guy. Let's get some shots of him. Let's see if we can land him. And there we are, guys. Nice big bass with the shaky head still in his mouth. Quickly want to get this guy on a lip grip, get a measurement of him. Let's get him back into the water. This time we have a striper. Also have a little large mouth following the striper. There we go. A little striper landed. Decent sized one. Getting a bit deeper out into the water. Granting us to some nice fish again. Don't have to catch some dinks. You can finally land some better fish. Forgot I'm bringing my little GoPro along. So let's see if we can get some underwater footage for releasing this guy it's gonna be very quick and there he goes straight back down all right ladies and gents been trying to fish for this fish for more than an hour using all sorts of things finally managed to get him this is going to be a new lifer for me. This will be my first black crappie. My first black crappie ever. There we go. Nice dark colors on this one. New lifer, first crappie ever. We're going to get some measurements on this one. Gorgeous. Got him on a little crappie jig. Having that suspended beneath a bobber. Been trying quite a while to get him. Let's quickly just get him some oxygen. All right, that's a 0 0.54 kilogram. So for four years, been fishing Lake Mead, trying to find crappie. Finally, got one. Got to see him next to the little tires. Threw a little jig at him, and we finally got one. Beautiful colors on them. Let's get this guy back to the water. and slowly making his way back to the tires in no rush. But that's it. Thank you guys for watching and I'll see you next time.